Welcome to this detailed explanation of the menstrual cycle, a vital physiological process that prepares the female body for reproduction. In this video, we'll explore each phase, the key hormonal interaction. The menstrual cycle is governed by a delicate interaction between the hypothalamus, pituitary gland, and ovaries, known collectively as the hypothalamic pituitary ovarian axis. This cycle tips. The menstrual phase begins with the shedding of the endometrial lining due to a sudden drop in estrogen and progesterone levels. This results in menstrual bleeding, the visible start of the cycle. During these first few days, hormone levels are at their lowest, and the pituitary glycation. During the follicular phase, rising levels of FSH stimulate several ovarian follicles, but only one becomes dominant. This dominant follicle secretes increasing amounts of estrogen. When estrogen peaks, it triggers a positive feedback loop on the pituitary, causing a surge in luteinizing hormone, or LH. This LH surge induces ovulation, the release of a mature ovum. After ovulation, the ruptured follicle transforms into the corpus luteum, which secretes progesterone and a smaller amount of estrogen. Progesterone prepares the endometrium for possible implantation by thickening and stabilizing it. If fertilization does not occur, the corpus luteum degenerates. Let's summarize. Follicle-stimulating hormone, or FSH, stimulates follicle development. Luteinizing hormone, LH, triggers ovulation. Estrogen rebuilds the endometrium, progesterone. Understanding the menstrual cycle is crucial in diagnosing conditions such as amenorrhea, polycystic ovary syndrome, and infertility. It also forms the foundation for contraceptive pharmacology and assisted reproductive technologies. The menstrual cycle is more than just a biological process. It's a remarkable orchestration of hormones, tissues, and time. For medical students worldwide, mastering this topic is key to understanding human reproduction and women's health. Global learning.